chapter 18 verse 18 of the book of Deuteronomy in the Bible narrates the promise of Almighty God to Moses about the coming of a prophet. I will raise them up a prophet from their brethren like unto thee and I will put my words into his mouth and he shall speak to them all that I shall command him. The Christians say that the promised prophet is Jesus Christ and Muslims say that it is Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. The Christians has no moral, religious or ethical right to say so because the Christians believe that Jesus Christ is God and Son of God. Prophets are mortals commissioned by Almighty God. How can God and the messengers sent by Him can be one and the same? And in the Acts of Apostles chapter 3 verse 13 even though Paul claims that the promised prophet is Jesus Christ. It is not substantiated by the Bible. In the book of Deuteronomy chapter 34 verse 12 it is stated. And there arose not a prophet sins in Israel like unto Moses. So the Bible itself says after the death of Moses no prophet similar to Moses was there among Israelites. So definitely the prophet belonged elsewhere. So let us compare prophet Jesus alayhi salam and Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam with Moses alayhi salam. Both Moses and Muhammad were born in normal manner just like all of us to a man and a woman. But Muslims and Christians believe that Jesus Christ was born to Mary without a male intervention. So similarity in the matter of birth is between Moses and Muhammad. While no such similarity exists between Moses and Jesus. Both Moses and Muhammad met with normal death. Whereas Christians believe that Jesus Christ was crucified and Muslims believe that Jesus was neither killed nor was crucified but was saved by Almighty God. So similarity in the matter of death is between Moses and Muhammad while no such similarity exists between Moses and Jesus. Both Moses and Muhammad had got married and had children and it is widely believed that Jesus Christ never married and got children. So similarity in the matter of marital status is between Moses and Muhammad while no such similarity exists between Moses and Jesus. Moses was forced to flee from the place where he was born to Medna. Muhammad too had to flee from his birthplace Mecca to Medina. Such is the resemblance in the cause of events that happened during their religious propagation. So similarity is there with Moses and Muhammad while no such similarity exists between Moses and Jesus. And both Moses and Muhammad were rulers and exercised authority over their people and formulated a jurisprudence based on religious edicts. But Jesus never exercised such authority. So when we compare these prophets without any nuance of doubt we can conclude that it is Moses and Muhammad who are similar and not Moses and Jesus. And further Almighty God said that I will raise a prophet from the brethren of Israelites. God did not say he will be from Israelites, from the brethren of Israelites. In this context the word brethren has got great significance. The prophet Abraham had two wives, Sarah and Hagar, that is Hajra. Prophet Isaac is a son of Sarah and Ishmael or Ismail is a son of Hagar or Hajra. The Arabs are the descendants of Ishmael and in the Genesis chapter 25 verses 17 and 18 it is stated that Ishmael died in the presence of his brethren. So the Bible says that Israelites are the brethren of Ishmael and vice versa. So this attribute is also applicable to Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam. Almighty God said that I will put my words into his mouth and he shall speak to them all that I shall command him. The glorious Quran says, Innahu la tanzilu rabbil alameen. The Quran is a revelation from Almighty God. And whatever our dear Prophet Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam spoke regarding religious matters were as per the directions and commands conveyed to him by Almighty God. And this aspect 
this undisputed fact that the promised prophet is Muhammad sallallahu alayhi wa sallam is confirmed in the New Testament. Gospel of John chapter 1 verse 21 narrates an interaction between the priest and Levitus.